Hi there Sunday Rocks, it's really good to be back with you again and it was fantastic to see some of you on Sunday at the um, Zine Family Challenge. It was great to see, you've all really grown up and it was lovely to see you all so I hope you had as much fun as we did. Well we've been learning in Sunday Rocks about some of the things that God has made and over the last few weeks we've been thinking about how kind God is. We've been thinking about how kind God is in giving us the sunshine and how kind God is in giving us the rain and in giving us all the beautiful things that we see around us. And I've got some pictures to show you because today we're going to be thinking especially about how God helps us to be happy. That's how kind he is. I've got some pictures of some people who mean a lot to me. I should have one of my husband but I couldn't find one. Um, but these are my children, Samuel and Silas and Abigail, and it really makes me happy to be around them. They're lots of fun, and as you saw last week with Silas, they're very funny as well. So it's, I really love being around those, that makes me very happy. Um, it's great being with our friends, isn't it? These are some of my friends, and we always have a great time. I love being around them, that really makes me happy. Some of the other things that makes me happy are um, being out in my garden. You've already seen my garden and I love doing things like growing seeds. I've got some of my seeds that I've been growing here. And I love the way um, that you put them in the ground and you don't see anything for a while and then they all suddenly start coming up. That really makes me very happy. And God is so kind in taking a tiny seed and growing it into something amazing. And... Doing lots of cooking makes me happy as well. I love um, looking through cookbooks and seeing how all the fantastic things that God has made for us to eat can be turned into really yummy things for us to feast on as well. So those are some of the things that make me happy. And God is so good because he has created all of those things um, that give me happiness in my life. And it would be really good for you to think about some of the things that you do that make you happy and how God has used the things he's made and how he's made you to help in that happiness. It could be that you love running around with your friends or cycling or going on your scooter and it's great isn't it that God has made you fit and healthy and given you legs and arms um, so that you can do that. It could be that you love spending time in a particular place maybe by the seaside or up on a hill or in a park and isn't it wonderful that God has made all of that beautiful countryside around that goes towards making you happy. It could be that being with your mums and your dads or your pets or your family really make you happy. And we've learned already, haven't we, that God made the animals, God made people, he made everyone that we see. So all of those things that make you happy, whether it's being out in the sunshine that God has given us, whether it's splashing in puddles when it's wet, whether it's going into the seaside, whether it's climbing mountains, whatever it is, those are all things that God has been so kind to give us to help make us happy. Isn't God good? And you know, even sometimes when we feel a little bit on the, sad on the inside, we still know that God is there giving us all of those wonderful things. So I hope that makes you feel a bit happy today as well. And we're going to say a prayer to thank God for all of those amazing things. So let's get rid of some of our wriggles. And let's talk to our Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, thank you that you are so kind to us and you help us to be happy. Thank you that you have given us families and friends and beautiful countryside. Thank you that you have given us lovely things to eat and lovely things to look at. Thank you for being so kind and for helping us to be happy. Amen. Wow. Well, let's have a look at some of the happy crafts that we're going to be doing today. And I'm really looking forward to seeing the photographs of some of these that you might want to send in to us as well. The first thing that you might want to do is to find um, a small box, maybe an old tissue box or a box that um, you've had some cakes or biscuits or something in. And your mums and dads should have a caption on the sheet that we sent through. And the idea for that is that you're going to decorate it with lots of beautiful things, make it really look like a happy box, and then we're gonna stick the caption onto that. 
So that's one thing that you could do. Then we've also got a sheet with these really lovely, happy, smiley faces. And the idea for that is that you're going to draw in some eyes, maybe some hair, noses, eyebrows. Um, and then if you want to, you've also got some little hats that you can cut out and stick on. I think those would make these people's faces look really happy. It might be that you've got other things that you want to stick on as well. So that's another thing that you could do. And then we've also got a collage sheet where you have some um, outlines of people that you might want to stick a colour and cut out and then stick around here. And onto here as well, you could cut out um, and find pictures of other things that make you happy, like food or flowers or things from outside or animals. And the last thing that you could do is um, our colouring sheet for this week, which has got the story from today. And then it's also got lots of things that God gives us to make us happy. Well, I hope that you have lots of fun doing that. And we'll look forward to seeing you again next week. So have a great week, won't you? Bye bye.